you have playoff fever, but do you have spring fever yet? It may not be uh, clear when we hear uh, Corey's uh, forecast calling for a chance of snow in April, but still, it's Alberta. And you're from we're Alberta. We've got Denise Wild, do-it-yourself expert, uh, here with some tips so you can spring into action when you want to start a deep cleaning, whether it's in your house, whether it's in your makeup bag, or whether it's in your shower. Thank yes. you so much for joining us. Thank you for having and me. And you grew Thank up, you. you live in Toronto now. Um, yes. And you grew up in the Bonneville uh, and Vermillion. area. And I did, yes. And tell me your story <laughs> about the Edmonton Oilers and the Stanley Cup. We were talking about hockey, so I yeah. was saying that when I grew up, I thought that the Stanley Cup was something that the Oilers owned, the other <laughs> cities, <laughs> and... Uh, teams would challenge them on, and that's genuinely and what you know I thought what? growing up. In the it 80s, kind of that was. was the case. It kind of Definitely. was. Yeah. Not so much anymore. Of course, you can tell that our city is completely hockey crazy right now. So it's great it's that great. Uh, you were able to come yes. and experience that for yes. a little while. All right, we're talking about uh, cleaning. Let's start with cleaning. cleaning our clothes. Yeah. So I'm talking about innovations in cleaning, mm -hmm. new ingredients, new technologies, and this is the Persil Pro Clean laundry detergent. This is the number one laundry detergent in Europe. It's brand new to Canada last year what they've done is they've gone through and tested stains specific to North America and they've put so enzymes. So what's specific to North America so, as opposed to Europe? Gravy, coffee, spaghetti sauce, chocolate ice cream, grape juice, you name it. So they're neater eaters in, they've uh, studied in Europe? <laughs> We do like to eat, put our food everywhere. Um, so they've studied it, they've tested it, they've put enzymes directly in the detergent that tackle that. And this is a Pro 10 formula, so it's more stain fighting, more brightening. They also have a cold water formula specific to Canada. I don't know if you knew this, but Canadians wash their laundry in cold water more frequently than Americans. I did not know that. Pretty and and why is that? Just because we're more conscious of the clothes? That and... could be it. More conscious of the fibers, more conscious of the environment. I'm or, not really sure. Or we're cheaper but... and we, want... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we don't want or to warm up, up here. Water. <laughs> I think so. So after you've washed your clothes, you're going to put them in the dryer with a snuggle dryer sheet. And this, of course, keeps your clothes feeling snugly fresh, nice and soft. Um, it also reduces static cling, reduces wrinkles, and then the freshness lasts for up to 30 days. So it yeah, gives all of your textiles. Yeah, you can actually use the dryer sheets to, to dust your house when you're actually spring cleaning. That's you know what? There are so use. many. Yes, there are hundreds of hacks online for things that you can do with the dryer sheet. So grab the snuggle and get around to cleaning up your Okay, house, yeah. let's talk about makeup brushes. How often yes. should you be cleaning your makeup brushes? Well, it depends on who you ask. Some okay. people say weekly, some people say monthly. I'm asking but, you, what are you <laughs> saying? <laughs> so I would say, a couple of weeks, every okay. couple of weeks. I guess okay. it depends on how often and how much makeup okay. you wear. So um, this is the latest innovation this in really makeup cool. brush I've cleaning. Never seen anything like this it. is called the, uh, this is a cleansing mat. It's a silicone cleansing mat. It's from Quo Cosmetics. Mm -hmm. It has suction cups on the underside. So yep. you stick this to the inside of your sink. It has six different textures on the silicone. You're gonna run your brush through the water mm -hmm. of your sink and then use all the different textures to help rinse that off. You've got the brush cleansing shampoo. Again, this is from Quo. They're both available exclusively at Shoppers Drug Mart. So with the shampoo and the brush cleansing mat, you just run them over all of the textures. So and it gets it, right in there, hey? It gets right in there. Just keep rinsing and running and rinsing and running. And you can do all different kinds. Um, argan oil, so it's good for synthetic and natural. And then can you put natural. this in the dishwasher or are you just gonna rinse it off? And, um, and it should be you definitely up. could, but you, you've already got the soap here, so I would just rinse it off okay. in the in the sink anyway. Awesome, perfect. All right, and then kind of run out of time, so quickly oh, let's talk about your our body. body. Yes, Dial has micro capsules. They release freshness and hydration for up to 12 hours. Another innovation in cleaning. This is their hibiscus water and their coconut milk body wash. So put them on, you smell fresh for up to 12 hours. But we're still going with the standard too, right? The of course, stone. you need all of your basics <laughs> when Old you're school. washing. Old and school. then they also have a head to toe hair and body wash, something for the whole family. So one bottle head to toe. All right, uh, perfect. Uh, one more tip. How do yes. you, uh, a spring cleaning tip, uh, how do you tackle it in your house? Where do you start? Uh, I would say start with the smallest area, the easiest thing to clean. I like to leave challenging things to the end. <laughs> but the so best thing. Bathroom? Is that, that's start a in the small bathroom area. for sure. But definitely look for two in ones. Look for things that make projects easier. Um, you know, look for multiple uses of different items. Make it easier for you. All right, love it. Easy. That is the key word, <laughs> and that is a good word. Thank you so much uh, Thank for you. coming.